I'm going to talk about conspiracy theories. First of all, I shot JFK. Yes, but the biggest conspiracy theory is that animals are treated well and all come from happy, small, red farm, or red barn, family farms. Yes, nice red barns where the animals roam free and happy. No. No. Nearly all of birds come from sick factory farms. Nearly all eggs, chicken, and most pigs. Over 95% of birds, actually 99% of birds, come from factory farms. So you might see some cows roaming around as you drive by a highway. Five, six cows, and you're like, oh, see, they're treated well. No, family farms are not providing food for 360 million people in America. Yes, human overpopulation is real. 360 million people eating 37 land animals per year. These are not myths or conspiracies. These are facts. By the way, did I mention I shot Tupac too? No, I didn't. I know who did though. But seriously, 360 million people overpopulating, eating 37 land animals per year. Land animals, not counting fish. 35 of them being birds. You'll never see birds roaming along the highway. Nearly all are raised in sick warehouses where they're manipulated in every which way. And factory farming has grown in popularity to be the majority since around the 1960s. And most are duped and fooled by the myths and propaganda of animal ag in the meat industry, factory farms in particular. So, like I said, billions of animals are not being raised on small family farms. Actually, factory farms are putting small family farms out of business at a rapid rate because they cut all corners at animals and quality expense, thus undercutting small family farms who are going under and closing. So, you don't need to pay people or hit men to force breed or rape cows. You are not a baby. You don't need the breastfeed from cows, udders. They're force breeding, raping, stealing for the and killing the calves for veal. So you can have the pus-filled bodily fluids. That causes acne. (laughs) Um, You don't need eggs or female hens, periods. Especially from birds that are raised in tiny battery cages the size of a file drawer per bird. Or overcrowded warehouses. Living in their own excrement. Where they debeak them because they overcrowd them and they'll peck each other. Where they... Throw away all the male chicks after they're hatched because they won't lay eggs and they're not the type for cooked flesh. Millions and millions of them on a weekly basis. Baby male chicks thrown away in the garbage because they're male and won't lay eggs and are not the type for cooked corpses or flesh. So, there's many other things. Branding, castrating, tail and ear docking, dehorning, branding that I mentioned. Branding, burning, live transport in all weather without even water, freezing cold or hot, sometimes longer distances, many more cruel standards. So stop falling for the lies and being gullible. They want you to believe them, and I know you're biased because you are addicted and want to believe them, but please share this. Or share the truth on factory farming, where nearly all animals come from. And free range, so-called free range, often lie. Yes, know your source, see them with your own eyes. Like you want to see a UFO with your own eyes. Before you believe it. And stop falling for the propaganda. They just want your money. And stop acting like Neanderthals. There's no need to eat or wear animals. 
these days. Vegan is the future. Thank you. Ooh, who shot JFK and Tupac? Ooh. If you wouldn't eat this guy, don't eat a little birdie. Thank you.